Hi guys, it's Will. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a bow and arrow out of just a pen and a rubber band. So, yeah. First, we're going to take a pen and we're just going to, like, one of the pens that have uh, the caps that you just pop the cap off. I'm going to take this top part and just pull it off. So then we have this, which is your arrow. So we're done with this for now. Then we have this. What we need to do is drill a hole right in the middle. So I don't really have a drill. So I just take a screw. I poke it through. Then just screw it with a screwdriver until um, until it's all the way through. And then once it's all the way through, just wiggle it around. Put it in on the other side and just wiggle it around to make it a little bigger so there's less friction with your arrow. So I'll be back when that's ready. Just in case you're wondering what I was doing, I made a little hole with a, uh, a box knife and, uh, and then I just put the screw in and uh, I just started screwing it and so it'll go through and go through the bottom pretty easily and then I'll get back when I'm done that. Once you get to about here you can unscrew it until this part of the screw is out, is, isn't is poking out of this side anymore. And once you do that, um, then once I do that, I'll be right back. Now that it's out of right there, we're just going to wiggle it around just to make that hole bigger. So like I said, there's not very much friction. There will be no matter what, but we're going to try to minimize that as much as possible. And once you have that, just unscrew it out. But I'm just going to do this for a little bit more. Now I'm going to unscrew it out. Now we have that weird stuff there. So we're just going to sort of whittle that off with a box knife. And if you want, you can just spin, just put the box knife in, spin it around, just to make the hole just a little bigger. And now, we're going to take our arrow, and then, so now we've figured out that this hole is too small. So, we're going to whittle it out a little more. And then, then once it's whittled out a little, we're going to cut off that excess stuff that we don't need. And then we're going to put it through one more time. Make sure it fits. It does. Now for this side. This hole is a lot smaller than the one on this side. So we're going to have to put, a, put the screw in that side. Screw it through. And then, we'll do the, and then whittle it out. So pretty much do the same thing as the other side. I'll be back once I do that. Now once you have both sides really 
big and hollow it out. You can put this in, and it should be able to slide out, slide in and out really easily. Now, once we've done that, once the bow's hole on off is pretty good, we're gonna take a rubber band and cut it so it's like this. I've already cut it, but it's like this, and then you just cut it. Now, I mean, tape might not sound really the best thing, but tape works pretty well. So you're going to tape that there, and tape that there. should look like this. And I'll be right back after I tape that. Tape down. Your bow and arrow is pretty much ready. You just pull it back like this, and then just let go. Don't hit people, because this actually is pretty good. I mean, uh, it shoots about 20 to 30 feet for me. So uh, don't shoot it at people. Unless, like, I don't know, but um, pretty much thanks for watching, and uh, see ya.